You're pleased to know I'm slightly less emotional this morning than I was last night. I feel like I need to give some sort of context to all of this um, upsetness and stuff that was last night. Because I don't think I've explained it very well. In fact, I know I haven't explained any of it really. You can't really balance on a bush, which is what this green thing is. Hopefully, you don't just fall off. Um, yeah, but yesterday was emotional, as you saw. I couldn't stop crying for hours. I was an idiot. And it's kind of a combination of a load of things, really. I think I can get through this today without crying. We'll see. Probably not. Um, but our friends at home yesterday. And that was just really upsetting. I'm going to miss them. And the thing with... There's a group of us of about, I don't know, six families or so that are always out every August. And we spend a lot of time together. And we've been doing it for maybe six years or so now. And with the villa being sold, I think I've explained already that my nan has sold this villa. And my sister is looking at buying a, um, a, an apartment here. But obviously that's all up in the air, so realistically we don't know at the moment whether we will be able to come back. I think probably we will be able to, but it, that's all kind of up in the air. Also, one of our friends, um, the one who went travelling last year, is moving to Manila in the Philippines. So we're not sure whether she will be able to come back next August. In fact, she's the one who has bought the house off, um, off my nan. So it's all just a bit complicated. <laughs> I don't know, it was just kind of yesterday, it was all sort of coming to an end, the day we're leaving and everything, and it was just really sad, so I'm going to start crying again now, so I'm going to, no. <laughs> See, like, I'm not going to mention it again, because I'm starting to cry, so end of the whole upset thing, and get on with it. <laughs> the villa now. Stephen and my sister have just gone in the pool, so I'm going to go in there and see what they're up to. <laughs> you okay? Did you have fun? Did Lara find you? Ooh. Nearly. Nearly. <laughs> Some good jump that, isn't it? We are <laughs> we're just heading out. We're going to go and get. I'm not really sure. I think it's getting a toasty or something from the cafe at the by the apartments. I don't really know. I've never been there before. My mum goes quite a lot, apparently. And we fancy a toasty. And how do they do toasties? Okay, thank you. I can smell them. Okay. Well, that's the weirdest. Oh, it's curry. Yeah. <laughs> it's curry. Yeah. <laughs> I thought it was ketchup. That's the ketchup. <laughs> Me and Stephen are just off down to the rocks. We're a little bit bored and lonely without our friends, aren't we? Yeah. We want to go home now. <laughs> it's rubbish. There's nothing to do. What was it? A 
car. Oh. Um, but saying that, as you know, I bought my drone and I haven't used it yet. Complete fail. So because I've not got the distractions of just sitting chatting, we're going to go down to the box and try and fly the drone. Well, you're going to fly the drone. Well, I'm going to fly the drone. Steven is just going to play. It is super quiet today. I don't know that everyone's kind of gone home or what the deal is. It's so quiet. Is it still open in the day? Uh, yes, I think so. Yeah, we've been in the daytime. I don't know where we're going to go, where the best place is to go. I'm not that confident about flying it near the sea, to be honest. Um, should we just give it a go? I'm just going to give it a go here. both sweaty pigs right now so we're gonna go and jump in the pool oh my god they're so warm can i take oh. yeah but if you like oh my goodness 